I have no choice but to be here to defend that place that is most sacred to me. And that's the summit of Mauna Kea. Now, construction of the 30-meter telescope is set to begin this morning on Mauna Kea, and it's being met with some big protest. We're told there were 33 people who were arrested. Today was an emotionally intense day for both sides because those who were arrested were Kapuna. Officials also say it was hard for them because the officers making the arrests were taking friends and family into custody. This is a fight about our mountain and about the sacredness of it and the intrusion of the astronomy industry on our summit for the last 50 years. Astronomy at its core is understanding the universe and our place in it. My dream is to work at one of the observatories on Mauna Kea. As a native Hawaiian, she says the telescope is part of her heritage. The Hawaiians found us through the stars. This is what our ancestors did. I can tell you that whatever is your concept of God, the discoveries of astrophysicists bring you closer to it. People are learning the history that is getting them to make certain decisions that they wouldn't otherwise make. The Hawaiian kingdom was overthrown in 1893. These insurgents obliterated the national consciousness of an entire population within three generations. And the response was, we're a miracle. We can do whatever we want. It's time for Native people to stand up for their rights. Mauna Kea is just part of the awakening. My name is like Kama Awakea, and I'm like the child of the Mona. I think that I want to protect my mom. Us Native Hawaiians are, are meant to be here. We are meant to continue to follow the stars as we go further beyond our planet. There's a whole world out there. There's a whole galaxy out there, you know, that we shouldn't limit ourselves. If it takes this kind of stand so that our children and our grandchildren don't have to suffer, don't have to fight, then we will stand here until the bitter end.